Welcome to the TriCount iOS app tutorial. I'm excited to share this app with you today because it's a very handy app when it comes to splitting costs with multiple parties or people. Um, like I said, this app is very handy when you are in a situation where multiple people or parties uh, purchase make purchases and at the end you need to figure out um, who owes who and how much so as we go through it you'll see how simple this process can really be when using TriCount. Here we are at the main screen um, you can see that I have some TriCounts already created for various things, mostly campouts. I love to go camping and it works out really great when figuring out uh, costs for everyone for food, campsite prices, and whether, whatever else uh, expenses there are. So to create a TriCount you simply just tap the create a try count icon and then go ahead and start to fill in the form that it gives you you need to name the try count usually I just choose the name of whatever event or trip it is that I'm on then for currency um, obviously choose the currency of whatever country you're in and then from there you're going to add the participants of this particular uh, event or trip and then a description if you'd like so here I have added uh, a couple participants for this demo trip and I've picked Sally, Johnny, Timmy and Sarah if I wanted to add another one I'd simply just tap add and it would give me another spot to add another participant. Now that I've created this try count, you can see that I do not have any expenses yet, so it's not showing me anything. I need to add an expense, just simply tap add expense, or even the plus sign in the top right hand corner. I name whatever the expense is, put the cost, and if you'd like, you can put when the expense was made. If you tap when, it will give you an option to choose a date. And then you select who paid for that particular expense. In this case, Sally paid for the gas. Now, down below that, it shows you that uh, all the participants were partied in this particular expense with a green check mark. Here's another expense that I added to our try count Mexican dinner, $62.78. This was paid for by Timmy. But I want but what I want you to notice is that Johnny was not at this dinner, so that he did not have to take part in paying for this. So his name is unchecked. To simply uncheck a name, all you have to do is tap the name you want to uncheck, and it will remove them from that expense. Again, this is very important for the times when the balance comes up. So now Johnny will not be responsible for paying for part of this expense. When you tap Details here on the left side, it will show you this uh, view that lists all of the participants of the expense and now you can add a number uh, for say a quantity or however many were in their party so in this particular situation they go to dinner Sally has one person with them Johnny has one person with them Timmy has one person with them and Sarah is just by herself so you can see that it breaks up the price according to however many people uh, were partied with each person. 
Now when the trip is over and it's time to get the balance, you can see that try count breaks it up very nicely for you. So in this particular situation, Sally owes twenty dollars and forty cents. Johnny is owed ninety two dollars and sixty eight cents. Timmy owes fifteen dollars and forty six cents, and Sarah owes fifty six dollars and eighty two cents. Now, when it comes to balancing the tri count, just below that, and this is one of my favorite parts about tri count, is it will make it so that there are the fewest amount of transactions that need to, to occur. So in this case, Sally should pay Johnny $20.39. Timmy should pay $15.46. And Sarah should pay $56.82. In this case, Johnny is the one that's being paid because he's the one that paid for the most expenses. Anyways, this is the TriCount app. Again, I really like it because it's really simplified my life when it comes to balancing the expenses of a trip that you've gone on. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and you find it very helpful for yourself. Thank you.